family and friends of missing Chula Vista mom Maya Miliete are taking their push to find her to the front of the Chula Vista Police Department. A rally was held tonight with the family as they spoke before the Chula Vista City Council earlier in the day for the first time since Maya went missing almost four months ago. Family members and advocates are calling on more resources to bring the missing mother home. Not knowing the whereabouts of a loved one is agonizing and horrible. No human being deserves to live through this nightmare. Since the very start, I prayed to God that the nightmare would end, but that day became tomorrow, and tomorrow became weeks, and weeks became months. It's been four months. We're still in the same place. We're still living in the same nightmare. Fox 5's Chris Beal is live at Chula Vista City Hall with more on what the family had to say. Chris. Yeah, Kathleen, on the one hand, this was the first time that the general public was allowed inside the council chamber since the start of the pandemic, but really any official business was overshadowed by this grieving family. It's been four months. We're still in the same place. We're still living in the same nightmare. This sister of missing Chula Vista mother, Maya Miliete, sharing her grief at Tuesday's Chula Vista City Council meeting. Give us resources to help find my sister and bring her to our three beautiful children. Bring her to us. The family of Maya and community members joining together in a rally and march from police headquarters to City Hall. Many of them had never even met this missing mother. We need to, to bring Maya home. Now missing since January 7th from the home she shared with her husband and three kids. Her car left in the driveway, cell phone turned off, no credit cards used. Members of the weekly and often more frequent search parties for Maya asking the city council to devote more resources to the Chula Vista Police Department in helping bring answers to the woman's children and family. The family in our group is demanding and asking that the mayor and the department step up to the plate and release their full resources. The city's mayor recognizing the frustrations of the family, wishing too that answers could come quickly. Our police are pouring all their resources into this and, and that they're using every technique that they can, every legal means that they can. And so I certainly hope that you find answers really, really soon. The police department putting out an update today saying it has served more than 20 search warrants in this case and followed up on more than 50 leads, including possible sightings of Maya in states as far away as New Mexico and Wisconsin. For now, we're live in Chula Vista. I'm Chris Beal, Fox 5 News. All right. Thank you so much, Chris. The family showing so much stamina and wherewithal in that case.